I was so excited to see this fella's name pop up on the birthday list this week. On the very week, we're talking about the people behind the people, Mr. Tony Berg. Tony Berg, who is either played with, engineered, and or produced um, everyone, including my band, Nickel Creek. He co-produced our record, Why Should the Fire Die, along with the great Eric Valentine. And Tony's production style is, shall we say, comprehensive. When we were recording the lead vocal for this next song, Tony came on the talkback mic in between takes and said, uh, great, Chris, really nice, really nice. You're just a little flat here and there, and um, just that last lyric, uh, in that last, you're, you're talking to God there, right? That, that you've always kept me safe for, you've always kept me safe. And I said, yes, yes. That, uh, okay, Chris, yeah, well, um, just what about all the people that, um, that God hasn't kept safe? Um, just something to think about. Let's try another one. Right after you read Thomas Hardy's Jude the Obscure, which I did and promptly rewrote this song, Tony Berg doesn't just produce your music, he produces your existential journey. Here's Doubting Thomas. When I've drawn my last breath Besides the folks I've met and the folks who know me Will I discover a soul-saving love Or just the dirt above took a promise but I do not feel safe or me of little faith Sometimes I pray for a slap in the face But then I beg to be spared Cause I'm a coward If there's a master of death I bet he's holding his breath His eyes show the blind And tell the deaf about his power I'm a dying Thomas I don't know what to say
Thank you for everything, Tony Berg. Happy birthday.